Hey everybody, welcome to those that are new, welcome back to those who have already subscribed, good to see you. Today is an awesome day. Today I'm on my way to the Abbotsford Airport to go meet with Jeff Ladder, Jeff Ladder Air Shows. If you don't know who Jeff is, Jeff's an air show pilot. He flies a Nanchang CJ6 and he performs from Central Canada all the west coast of Canada. I'll put a link to his website below. You should check out if he's performing near you. If so, go and see him perform. It's awesome. And if he's not performing near your local air show, go anyways. It's an air show. They're awesome. So Jeff is going to make a dream of mine come true today. I can't believe it's happening. But we're flying aerobatics today. This whole thing came about because Jeff puts on a fundraiser every year for Movember. If you donate over 100 bucks to his charity, you get a chance in order to win a flight with him in his Nanchang CJ6 Nancy. Obviously it's a no brainer, I did it. And look at, boom, one. I can't believe it. Horseshoes, horseshoes. Uh, we've been working on this flight for like the last couple of weeks. The weather's been sort of iffy. Today is looking primo. So I'm super pumped to bring you guys along for the ride. I hope you don't get sick. I hope I don't get sick. Let's go to the airport, find Jeff, and see what's in store. Just uh, got to the Abster Airport, got all the gear. Now we just gotta find Jeff and go see what's uh, gonna happen. Got my dad here to help film. It's gonna be a great day. So let's get right down to the briefing stuff here. So we're gonna go off for the flight of a lifetime. By the way, thanks, by the way, hey, for, thank uh, you. for being part of our Movember. Um, thanks for picking my uh, name, Jeff. You're a great person to win it. Yeah. Um, you're a great person to win it. I, but I do appreciate, and uh, really any, everybody that supports the Movember and we, we raise money. Yeah. We use this airplane for a variety of different charities and a lot of different charity air shows and stuff like that. But Movember is probably one of the ones I'm, I'm, I'm most, uh, most proud to be associated and with. And we'll, we'll put a link to his Movember fundraiser in the comments below. And uh, if you want to donate, Yeah, please, please donate. do. Please do. And you too could win a flight of a lifetime. Uh, there are some absolutely beautiful, stunning places to fly around yeah. the lower mainland. And yeah. we're going to go take a look at them. Yeah. We'll get out. It's going to be about, once we get up and underway, it'll be about 40 minutes in the air. Sometime in that time frame, 40, 45 minutes. But it will take a bit of time to get going because we have to warm up the engine. So these older airplanes, you can't just turn them on like a car and drive. We have to warm up the cylinder head temperatures. We need to warm up the oil temperatures. And then we need to do a systems check. We call it a run up. So we'll run the engine up. We'll check a bunch of systems. So the whole thing will probably be uh, about an hour. Um, so we'll head out and uh, we'll fly out there. There's two sticks in the aircraft. And so uh, I'll be able to, to guard the controls. Yeah. Um, but I will invite you to, to grab that stick and feel what it it's like, like to fly a vintage warplane. Awesome. What we'll do is we'll start off with a couple of what we call 60s and 2s, or 60 degree bank and 2G turns. Okay. And we'll just kind of play with those a little bit. And that's okay. going to give you a sensation of what it kind of feels like to maneuver around in the aircraft. By then you'll probably have uh, already have a pretty good idea, but we'll do those as a warm-up maneuvers. Okay. And then from there, I think we'll just uh, start exploring the flight envelope of the aircraft and awesome. see what you're ready for from there. Sounds After good. After that, we'll fly around, take a look at the mountains. Um, we may, while we're doing our warm-ups, do that. Perfect. Um, it's, I mean, it's just something to yeah. see. Yeah. And, then, uh, and then after that's done, we'll come back here. And now's the perfect time to show you the parachutes. All right. Okay. But they essentially are like a backpack. You never ever put a parachute on inside the airplane, only outside the airplane. Okay. And this is a safety measure in case you ever needed to jump. Uh, you would remember to bring it. But they clip like this. And then you tighten them. Okay. and pull these handles down. I'm not going to tighten it super tight right now, but you want them fairly tight. Yeah. So when you stand up, it's uncomfortable. And then if you needed to get out of the air, aircraft, then we're going to take that canopy back and disconnect that helmet. 
Put your right hand up on that uh, the frame. You'll see it where to do it when I show you the airplane. Yeah. Disconnect your belt. You want your hand here in case it's being violently tossed around. You've got something to brace on. Yeah. Disconnect your belt in one spot. Get out of the aircraft. Once you're out, take this D-ring handle with two hands and yeah. you pull it straight out. And it will have you upright and floating to the ground okay. very quickly. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. That's our little tag. Hashtag, let's do this. Hashtag, let's do this. All right. Seat out. Step up here. Sit into the stand into the seat and then stand on the two foot pads on the side. Okay. You can see those two cables down there? Those are rudder cables. You can't put your feet on those when you're flying either. Okay. Okay. Now lower yourself into the seat. So okay. the seat fits in the bucket. It's perfect. Okay. Excellent. Comfy? Comfy. So that's pretty much it for you. You're buckled in. Got all your stuff? Yep. All right, I'm gonna close the hangar, hangar doors. Okay. Get the cameras on and we'll get yep. out here.
South China Jet, uh, keeping it in tight to approved, clear to land, runway 01. Clear to land, South China Jet. Walking to park, Ricky, okay, buddy, you can open your cap, anytime. Alright, sounds good. What an experience, Jeff. Thank uh, you so much, man. Oh, man, I'm, I'm super stoked that uh, it's just you that won it. I, uh, man, I... <laughs> Well, thanks guys for tuning in, watching the video. I hope you had as much fun watching it as I did experiencing it. It was amazing. Can't thanks enough to Jeff for taking me on this awesome flight. Uh, I just, nothing really much to say besides, wow. Um, really gives you a perspective of like how much work these guys put into flying these beautiful warbirds. Uh, for air shows or just keeping the, the heritage alive. It's just unreal. Um, again, thanks for tuning in. We'll see you guys in the next one. And if you want to find out more about Jeff, check the link below. I'll put his website. All right, thanks guys. We'll see you in the next one.